Hey everyone, I'm making a really quick over the shoulder tutorial to show you how to send emails to your get response list. The people that don't open the email you sent out earlier in the day. So I'm going to go ahead and squish my face and show you what's up. Don't laugh at my stats today. My stats are horrible. So I'm just going to have to lay it out there on the line. Stats are bad today. <clears throat> okay. This I actually just sent out, right? Only 1.19% opened. This is the third email based off the first email I sent. First one, whoever didn't um, open the email got sent another one in a whole different way. I wrote a whole nother email, sent them to the Facebook video instead of the blog. And uh, when those people that didn't open, I just sent them a direct request to come to the Hangout tonight at, at 9 o'clock for the fireside chat. So this is how you do it. You go to the, the email that you sent out last, right? See if I can move my face around. So here it is loading. See if I can move this around too. I think I can make it even bigger. Here we go. And um, what you'll be able to see here is the 83 unopened. You go ahead and click email group. You're leaving stats and go creating message for this save search. Yes. New email creator. You go ahead and write your subject. Excuse me. Right. Go to your next step which is off the screen that you can see right here. Go ahead and select a template. I'm going to go from scratch. Um, I'm going to pick a blank template. Move over here a little bit. I'm going to make sure the text is the text box there. Let's see if I can do that. There we go. We can move this back this way. We don't need to see the preview. And what you do is you just right away write your next email. To the run opened messages message receivers from before last email right I can't spell I never said I could I know I I, I depend on my looks you know to get me through that <laughs> so okay so you go ahead and you add your image blocks whatever the heck you like to add your uh, lines I like to add the line to keep my unsubscribe separate from my email add your social sharing whatever it is that you like to do there okay boom then your next step is you go to next step Let me go ahead and move my face again and right here it's going to give you your spam score that's this is on get response that's what the average email gets is 1.10 anything higher you might want to double check and make sure it doesn't end up in someone's spam box or in the promotionals. It's up to you. And all you got to do is send it. I'm not going to send it because these people that um, didn't open my first email today and didn't open my second email today have just gotten their third email from me today. So people will either be unsubscribing and getting off my list if they're just going to sit there or they're going to start paying attention to me because I'm in their face. You know, that I really, that from last night's, uh, last night's boot camp for me that was the strongest thing that I learned was really how to dig into that list you know these people opted in they opted into your list they want to be there and maybe they're just busy and you ever do that I know I've done it you know there are very few people that I make sure that I open their list if you're on my team I make sure I open every one of your emails and click through every one of your links because I want it to be a successful email run for you I want your stuff to get delivered um, people like Lisa Torres I, I open every single email she sends me and I watch everything that you know whatever link through she's got I open it now not everybody gets that treatment from me so you might be just outside that that spectrum 
And I got to tell you, honestly, Lisa kind of made me open her emails and it didn't piss me off. And what's the worst that would have happened? I would have unsubscribed. I know that I enjoy getting the emails from Lisa. I know that I enjoy learning from Lisa. So why not start paying attention? If, if I'm going to get three emails a day out of her because I didn't bother to open the first one, then maybe I should start opening the first one, right? So it's, it's really, really great that she taught us this little trick. I'm super excited about it. And yes, you can do this with Get Response even easier than the Aweber. So this one's for you, Amy, and anybody out there that is looking to really revitalize their list a little bit and get people to notice that you're actually sending them email and, um, you know, either make them unsubscribe or open it up and see what you've got to offer. This is Coach Tara. I will see you later. Bye.